Second Presbyterian Youth Group went to Puerto Rico this year. They took two groups. Um, the first group had 20 students and the second group had 30 students. And we helped restore a Presbyterian camp in Puerto Rico. At the Presbyterian camp in Puerto Rico, there were campers there also, and we became really close with a lot of the camp counselors and a lot of people um, through the church at the camp. And um, they taught us how to dance, and we had a huge water fight, and it, it was just a lot of fun, and we became really close with everybody there, and we still keep in contact to this day. I really enjoy being with people that age. They make me laugh. They make me feel younger. And I really like having the opportunity to watch them in small groups when all of a sudden, every now and then, one of them gets it. And you see this little spark of, oh, I understand what it means to be a Christian, to do God's work, to be here in the mission field. And, and that's what makes it worthwhile for me. You get the opportunity to talk to kids in a way that you don't when it's here and it's Sunday night and people are running around. Different food, different culture, different idea of what time means, and, um, and it's, gr it's a growing experience for everybody. Like each week, each trip is unique in that so you have a different constellation of students, you have a different constellation of adults, and sometimes both weeks are doing completely different work. I think everybody should go on the mission trips because it is a great way to um, get closer with God, um, have great friendships within your church community, and also to help others and it's just a carefree, stress-free week and it's a lot of fun and it's a great way to just get away and get closer with God and everybody should call them. Helping people isn't why you're there. Serving God is why you're there. And you never know what that's going to look like. probably the best week of my whole summer each year.